Hi, I'm Tom Davies, and uh, I didn't feel like working today, so it's uh, we thought we'd take a, a little trip up to Boonville, and uh, just what a gorgeous day we have here. This is Jose, our vineyard manager, and uh, we're about an hour and a half um, north of the winery. We're about a half hour from the coast from here, Jose? It is more or less four or five minutes, and we yeah. get to the ocean. Get yeah. to the ocean, and so we're in a place called the Anderson Valley, and of all the ranches that we own here at Visatui, this is the most beautiful. This is the most idyllic little valley here. It's only, what, about five, ten miles long, something like that? Uh, more or less. Yeah, yeah and, less. and maybe only a couple miles across. And we have about 50 acres up here, which we have about, what, 35 acres? It is, cultivation. It is 35 uh, acres in cultivation, yeah. 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 And, uh, yeah, you have... Uh, White white riesling by right, the road. Right, right. And then uh, pin, I mean uh, pinot noir. Yeah, that's and that's what we just grafted this year, right? Yeah. That's neat. And uh, half of the block yeah. here, number four. You mm -hmm. know, you have pinot grigio right, right. here. Right. Oh, yeah. And uh, gobertomina yeah. across the river. Yeah, that's neat. Well, yeah. you know, and uh, we've been making a wine at Visatui, our white riesling with the Anderson Valley Appellation. It's one of my favorite white wines. And one of the reasons, too, I think it does so well is that this valley is much cooler than the Napa Valley. And so with a wine like the Wurstraminer, we get some really good acids and really bright fruit, and uh, it's a delicious wine. And then we just grafted, what, about nine acres uh, to uh, Pinot? Twelve. Twelve acres. Twelve. Uh, yeah, that's around three acres in the block number four. Right. And around nine in the block number four. No, that's three. right. That that block's nine, yeah. three over here. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, some of you have probably heard about the quality of Pinot coming from the Anderson Valley, and it's it's probably one of the tops here in California. And uh, do you remember how many different clones that we put in? I really don't know, Tom, yeah. David, that, that, but I, yeah. I don't know. Yeah, I think mm -hmm. we put about five different clones and including the Latache clone mm -hmm. from France was all the great uh, from the DRC clones from uh, from France the most famous clones of Pinot then Calera is one of them and so well, you think we'll get f any fruit this uh, coming year or it's probably two more years till we get some fruit mm, this coming year you're going to get some not yeah. not a lot yeah. what we expected but you're going to yeah. get some yeah. because it's the graft yeah, yeah. but you're going to get yeah, you're gonna get bit, some huh? to make wine. What, out of it. Um, how long have you been living here, Jose? I've been living here in the valley for 27 years. Wow, yeah, yeah. how lucky you are! This is such a beautiful place. Yeah, this is the place I yeah. I always like when I came. Yeah. I say, well, this is the place where I want to die if she's take me. <laughs> <laughs> me the, uh, and so, how long have you been managing our ranch up here for, Jose? Right here, uh, around seven years. Yeah, yeah. Six Boy. or seven years. Mm -hmm. And uh, you're doing a great job. You know, the, the quality you know. that uh, that we get from this ranch, I think, is primarily due to you because yeah. you probably know every single vine. In fact, when we saw you here early this morning, yeah. you were counting the vines, right? Yes. To yeah, I believe, you know, to get the nice grapes you mm -hmm. get, I have to start with the my first goal is the, the frost profession. Yeah. The second one, the spray. Yeah. I mean, you spray. And right. And then... It, they work with the, the mother nature takes it from there. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Well, again, we didn't feel like working today, so Karen and I thought we'd come up and see you, and I think we're going to head over to the coast, maybe find some crab or something, mm. and uh, just enjoy this beautiful day. And uh, what is it? It's about almost 60 degrees here today. Uh, they say 65, wow. 66. That's so amazing. It's, here it is, the 30th November. And uh, for all, yous that, all you that might be watching this in the East Coast, uh, yeah. <laughs> they're probably uh, are jealous of this great weather that we have. But soon the rain will come. Yeah. And uh, normally we get our rainy season here during the winter. And and, uh, and we need the rain because we have a little reservoir up here. Yeah. The only way we can fill it is basically from rainfall. Yes, yes. And then I'm pretty sure you're going to hit the same weather in the, uh, in the coast. Yeah, yeah, it should be beautiful out oh, there. Yeah. Well, Jose, thank you for taking a couple minutes, and, and thank you for doing a great job. Thank you And don't forget, you coming to the Christmas party next week? Yeah, the 9th, yeah. Yeah, yeah. that should be fun. We're going to have a great restaurant. We'll drink some good wines. Mm -hmm. and. I'm going to take my wife with me. So. Good. That's good. Well, ho ho are you going to stay overnight, I hope? Uh, I'm going to stay. Yeah. I'm going to Try to figure out a place because you, you don't have to drive back. Oh, I don't. I'm yeah. not going to drink. No. I go with my wife and I can just enjoy with yeah. you guys. Yeah. And yeah, right. we good. come. Maybe one glass. <laughs> All right.
Yeah. All right. Thanks, Jose. Dumb. Thanks nice again. To meet you. All right. Yeah, nice seeing you.